Yeah. So it's doing well for the business owner, but how about for the customer? So you call, you, you, you're chatting with them. I want to know the store hours. I get it. The shark bot can tell me that it closes at 5 p.m. But what if I want to talk to a human to talk to them about getting me a refund or maybe thinking outside of the box if something didn't go right? It does have limitations. But right now, you know, there are a billion people that are interacting with chatbots around the globe, and they probably don't even realize that it is technology. They might think that they're speaking to a human being, but because it is getting that can be deceptive, but I think we just need to be aware of the fact that that's just the way of the world, right? If we have voice bots as well, that when you're calling and you're getting information, you're kind of like, yeah, yeah, it's not a human being. No, it's not. So well, you're a human being, you're like, wait a minute, what, what's happening? So they're getting better, and it's harder to detect, but. If it's heavily conversions on the business end, that's from my perspective. I'm like, it works wonders. We want to implement it for our clients so that they can get, you know, a part of that money that's happening right now. Just multiple billions of dollars, $23 billion in savings by implementing chatbots.